Hello, 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 everyone. Class is in session. I'm just kidding. Get it? Because, you know, the whole school thing. Anyway, this is like my mom's little at-home classroom. She turned my old room into like this classroom. And I like this desk. It's like really nice. And I've been really like productive. I don't know if it's because it's, like the whole like school thing. I don't know. But I feel very productive. That's why I sit here. Anyway not really class we're gonna get ready it's gonna be a date night we're gonna get ready we're gonna do skincare and our hair and our makeup we're gonna have so much fun so we're going to start this off with doing a berry scrub i love doing a scrub it exfoliates your face it gets rid of all of the dullness it makes you you know look alive and rejuvenated and look healthy and sexy and just you know, so I'm going to put my hair up, lift that up. No nipples for you, babies. <laughs> and I'm going to take, it comes with like the little spatula. And this thing is always so hard to open. Come on, okay. Fabulous. So it's open. I'm going to take the little spatula because, you know, sanitation. You got to be sanitized, even though this is mine. You still got to be sanitized. I'm just going to take a tiny little bit and just... Actually, I can't really see. I'm going to do it in the mirror right here. Put it all on your face. And this mask is really good. Well, this is like an exfoliator mask, but it's still good because it's not made with like plastic beads, like say the um, St. Ives. And St. Ives literally made my skin so irritated. Like, yeah, it exfoliated and my skin was so soft, but it like made like micro tears on my skin. So I was like, more prone to acne which was like doesn't make any sense if you're trying to get rid of that you know so i like this because it's made with pomegranate seeds as the exfoliator so it's super gentle if you have sensitive skin you could definitely use this and it's absolutely fabulous like your skin is so glowy after and it's just amazing now you're supposed to use this after you cleanse your face with your cleanser but i never pay attention and i don't like to follow rules sometimes so i do it before i leave it on just a tiny bit and then i cleanse after so i'm just gonna put this on spread it out Oh my god, this feels so good and it smells divine. Oh. Mm -hmm. And plus, I like to do this before I shave my face. I don't actually like shave it with the razor. I use the flawless little um razor thingy. And I just feel like it gets like all of the hairs. Like, it doesn't, like, skip anything. It doesn't give me, like, dry skin. It, it doesn't pick up the dry skin. Because I feel like when I shave my face with that, it picks up more so the dry skin than actual hair, which is so gross. So I just leave it like this. I let it marinate a little bit to get into the skin. And plus, I like to smell the berryness, you know? I'm going to put this on... And then I have like a, a little bit, I don't want to like give you the birdie. <laughs> I have like a little bit left, so I just like to I sort of waste it on like a napkin. I just like to put it on my neck. You know, your decollete, whatever. And then you just let it sit. I got my Coke and then I got my pizza rolls. And I'm just going to have some fun because what? It's self-care. It's self-care. It's what? It's self-care. <laughs>
my scrub is off i don't know if you can see it's kind of dark in here but um my skin looks so good so clear and now i am going to put my rejuvenic oil all over my body i shaved my legs and my kitty cat so i like to put this all over my body after i shave and even after my shower because it just like nourishes the body and you can use this oil for everything scalp treatment hair treatment moisturize for the body moisturize for your kitty you could moisturize your dry skin your callus your cuticles it's good for everything so you don't have to get all these different lotions and potions and oils you can literally have this one thing and you could use it for everything so it's an absolutely i didn't even do my decollete it's an absolutely amazing product to have you don't even have to spend money on other lotions and other oils to do for different things like cuticle oil and hair oil and hair shine and and um fly away whatever and um intense uh, foot cream you don't have to get all these different things because this rejuvenic oil helps everything so it's absolutely really amazing so after i do that i am going to shave my face before i put on my skincare so i'm going to take my flawless and then i'm just going to pull this back now that i have a clean slate i just like to take out all the peach fuzz that i have with this And not only does like my bone structure come out more when there's not a shadow of peach fuzz, but it puts on the makeup so much more um, smoother. I love this thing. And I also have the body one as well. And this is for when I don't feel like shaving my legs and I have a little stubble. I do that with my arms as well. The only thing with that is that um, if you have like loose skin or if you have like stretch marks, it catches onto that and it hurts so bad and it leaves you with like, excuse me, it leaves you with cuts. So you have to be careful with that one. This one is really gentle and easy. I actually have to get another one of these thingies because it's um, tugging on my skin because I think this is like made of gold or something. I don't know, but um, it's not as smooth as when I first got it. Okay. And now that that is done, I'm going to take my skincare. I have my Botox in a bottle serum, the Rewind. Here's my eye cream, I have my eye cream. And then I also have my moisturizer, which is absolutely fabulous. And I was in the shower taking off the um, the berry scrub. I did my Be Balanced cleanser. I washed it off. So now I'm just going to take a little bit of the eye cream and put it on. This is really good if you have dark circles, fine lines. If you're puffy, this gets rid of all of that. And it makes you look more alive, more awake hydrated if you have dry under eyes it's really good i love this eye cream and i've had it for three months already and i still have like a whole bunch left you literally need only a tiny bit so the skincare lasts so it's definitely worth the price tag next i'm going to take a pump and a half of the um both socks in a bottle rub it in my fingers pat it on the neck and then the decollete and this also gets sort of fine lines uneven skin tone gives you elasticity it makes you more plump it's absolutely fabulous Oh, so good and then whatever is left i just put on my hands because your hands get older faster than you think and then the moisturizer as well i don't know if you can see how much i have left because it's 
a white cream inside of a white bottle. But three months as well, I had this. And I still have. You literally need the most tiniest amount. Because that is how potent our products are. That you only need a tiny bit. And it does your whole entire face, your neck, and your decollete. It's definitely worth the investment. Plus, it's vegan, cruelty-free, Leaping Bunny approved. Because a lot of times, vegan products, products that are marketed as vegan, aren't truly vegan. They just are vegan with a whole bunch of chemicals in it. And the only way to tell if an item is truly vegan is if it is Leaping Bunny approved. And these products are Leaping Bunny approved, so super amazing. Now that that is done, I am going to get dressed and then I will come back to do this hair. All right, I'm dressed. I am now going to start doing my makeup. Uh, I still don't know what kind of look I'm doing. I think I'm going to do natural because natural just is like, huh. Natural with a cute little pop of color. Nothing extravagant. Now I'm debating if I'm going to do a blue line or a silver line. I'll do silver. Okay. Now I'm going to just fill in my brows just a tiny bit. I'm just going to take my e.l.f. eyeshadows. And then I'm going to take the brown right here with an angled brush. And I'm just going to fill these brows in. I'm going to use the mirror to dry here. I don't like to do them too thick. And I don't like them too dark, which is why I don't use a pomade. I just use a powder just to put a little bit of color in, just to fill in the sparse areas. Because I hate dark eyebrows. I think they're so unflattering and so ugly. So I just like a little bit of color to fill in the sparseness. And then I'm going to take my CoverGirl Clear Gel. It's like a mascara, a clear mascara, and a brow gel, whatever you want to use it for. I use it for brow gel. And I just bring these babies down. Fabulous. So now that that's done, I'm going to take my. What is on here? This? I'm going to take my. Um, concealer now and I'm just going to put a dot here and a dot there and what this is going to do is just going to put a um a good base for the eyeshadow that's there I'm just going to take the skin color I don't know if you can see the skin color right there I say I'm going to do a very natural look I'm just going to and I'm going to pack it on just like that. You don't want to rub it in and sweep it. You would want to just pack it so that the color can actually go on. Because when you sweep it, you're just going to sweep off all the color. So I just like to pack it just so that the color can pack on. And now I'm just going to take a mixture of these two so that I can put some in the crease. And to deepen this outer V, I'm just going to take the same color that I did on my eyebrows with the same brush. 
and just go into that little pocket and then blend it into the the crease just to add a little bit of dimension to the top. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's so hot. Mm -hmm. Okay, now that that's done, I'm going to take my eyeliner. This is the Avon True Color Glimmer Stick in Diamond. I'm just going to take it. It's so pretty. And then I'm going to pinch the skin that's right over here, just so I can get a clean line. Now that that is done, I'm going to take my mascara. And this mascara was actually dry before. It was getting dry. So what I did was put a couple drops of the Rejuvenic Oil to put in here. And it just loosened up the dry, sh um, dry shampoo. <laughs> the dry mascara that was on the corners. And you just mix it all up. And then it gets wet again. And it just revives it. And plus, you're getting look at the conditioning things from the conditioning components from the rejuvenic oil onto your eyelashes. So it's moisturizing them while getting your mascara on. You see two birds with one biscuit. Fabulous. I honestly don't even put concealer or anything on my face. Plus with the mask and everything, it's gonna be covering half of it anyway. So I only do my eyes, my eyebrows, and then that's it. And then my mask is on, so I'm good. So that was my makeup. Now it's time to do this hair. Mm. Oh, excuse me. This clip is like stuck okay. so i was thinking i was like do i keep it natural do i not keep it natural it was like in a bun so my natural curl is like kind of like died um so i'm just going to i washed my hair last night so my hair is fairly clean so i am going to blow my hair out because i haven't had my hair blown out in a while been like two weeks since I've had my hair blown out and I like having my hair blown out so I'm gonna blow my hair out okay so to prep my hair I am going to since I didn't put this on this morning which is the intense repair treatment and what this is is a spray that helps your hair grow I didn't put it on this morning you're supposed to do this two times a day so I'm going to do that now since I'm going to blow my hair out I put this on all over my hair and what this does is it jump starts your hair growth so like where areas you are lacking growth or if it like came out like traction alopecia or whatever this will actually help your hair regrow it stimulates the reg the re what is that um it stimulates the regeneration of your hair follicle so i just spray it onto my scalp and then you just rub it in like my baby hairs right here they're finally growing in you can see them here which is absolutely amazing because i was bald there for a while and now it's finally growing back in slowly but surely so this is an absolutely amazing product to have so i put that I spray it all over my hair, even though that's my only problem area, a thinning edge, and it's finally growing. So I was like, you know what, if it works for that, it could work for my whole head. So 
I've been spraying it and it's been growing my hair and it's absolutely fabulous. Oof. So now that that is all rubbed into my scalp, and the good thing about these products is that they penetrate into your hair and your skin super quickly. Like it's not just gonna sit there on top like other products. That's why I really love these products because they actually penetrate into your hair. And it heals from the inside out since they all have rejuvenic oil in it. So now I'm going to take the blowout cream. This is what it looks like, the blowout cream. I'm going to take just a tiny bit and then I'm going to put it into my hair. And this is going to reduce the frizz. It's going to give you a nicer blowout. Again, they're not products that just sit on top of your hair like others. This actually seeps into your hair and it doesn't damage and it doesn't make the appearance of it look like it's like all healthy and nice. It actually heals your hair from the inside out and it penetrates inside so it doesn't like burn or anything like that. And then I'm going to take the heat protectant spray. Just put a little bit in. I just put a little bit of the heat protectant spray because the blowout cream has a heat protectant component in it. So I just put like a tiny bit just for added, you know, protection. All right. And I already put my leave-in conditioner in this morning, which is this. So I'm not going to put it again today. And then after I washed my hair last night with the black shampoo and the Intense Repair Treatment Conditioner. No, the Intense Repair Conditioner, not the Intense Repair Treatment Conditioner. Um, I washed my hair with the black shampoo and the Intense Repair Conditioner. And then after I got out the shower, I towel dried my hair and I put the Rejuva Beats in and the Leave-In Conditioner. So that was that. Um... I'm just brushing all of the products through so that each hair strand can get the goodness of it all. And if you want, you could put just like a tiny drop of rejuvenic oil in, but I'm not going to. I don't want too much product in my hair, you know? And you see how like how much product I put into my hair and it doesn't look way down at all. Like it just looks like, yeah, it's poofy because I just brushed it, but... It doesn't look weighed down like it would if I did other products. Okay, so I'm just going to put this up. Okay, so now I'm going to take my trusty Revlon One Step Blow Dryer. I think that's the name of it. The, the blow dry brush from Revlon. And then... done it's straight oh, it feels so good you see how i don't need the rejuvenic oil on the ends of my hair because it just looks fine it looks good but this is my hair and honestly if you want to add just like a tiny bit of um volume whatever you could put some dry shampoo put it under and then just like you see the difference with the volume wow you see how flat and then it's just like boom so you could definitely do that so just add some volume even if you just washed your hair you could definitely put the dry shampoo because it doesn't just wash your hair, like wash your hair. Um, 
by seeping up all of the oils that is in your hair but it also like gives you some volume so it's definitely so good <sighs> so that is it that's my hair my makeup my skincare using mostly monet products if you are interested in getting any of them you can definitely hit me up these products are absolutely amazing they changed my hair and my skin and my life because i take the um the probiotic right here and my bowel movements are so much more regular now i'm not bloated i'm not gassy which is absolutely fabulous so if you're ready to start the monet journey by changing the products that you use you will definitely not regret it and i can't wait to help you with your journey thank you so much for watching and i will see you next time